Television broadcast began in Britain in 1936 and in the United States in 1939. At first few people owned television sets, and the cameras, transmitters and receivers could process images only in black and white. Since then the popularity of television has grown enormously, especially since the introduction of color television in 1953. One of the pioneers of television was John Logie Baird. In 1926, Baird demonstrated a system called the Baird Televisor. It used a rotating disc with a spiral of lenses, called a Nipkow disc, to divide an image into horizontal lines. Scottish electrical engineer and inventor John Logie Bird from 1888 to 1946 was the first person to transmit a television picture by radio waves. He applied for patents as early as 1923, and worked almost until his death of new methods of transmission. But how television works? Let's explain. Light detectors in a TV camera convert light into electric signals, which are processed before being transmitted as radio waves. The screen of television is the front of funnel-shaped glass tube. The inside of the screen is coated with strips of phosphorus chemical that glow three different colors when electrons hit them. Three electron guns at the back of television tube fire beams of electrons at the three sets of phosphorus behind the screen, which illuminate to create the picture. Each lens would focus a horizontal line from the image onto a photoelectric cell. The cell produced an electrical current that varied with the amount of light that fell on it. The process, called mechanical scanning, converted the image into a series of signals that could be transmitted as radio waves. The receiver turned signal into a light of varying intensity. When this light passed through another Nipkow disc, it reproduced the image on a screen. Modern television sets use electron guns to produce beams of electrons, which paint television images in lines on a screen. The beams are reflected by electrically charged plates that steer the beams from side to side and from top to bottom. Chemicals called phosphorus glow when the beam hits them. Standard European television systems use 625 line per frame, or image, and 25 frames per second. Japanese and US system use 525 lines and 30 frames per second. High definition television, or HDTV, uses 1125 lines to give sharper, more detailed images.